Oh, there we go. Why how the heck do I get in here? Hello, anyone home? What do you want? I'm looking for the saviors. Don't know what you're talking about. I'm one of Brecken's men from the tower. I don't care where you're from. Get your ass out of here or I'll stop being so fucking polite. Listen, I know you're smuggling people out of the slums. There's a girl who came through. Jade? I think you better get the hell out of here. No, just listen. I cut Rise up and now his whole goddamn gang is after me. I could use some cooperation here. You? You're the one who chopped Rice's hand off? Yeah, and now I have to get to Sector Zero. What's your name? Crane. Well, Crane, you're in for some heartbreak if you think going to Sector Zero will get you off Rice's shit list, but wait here. I got a guy here who claims he's the one who took Rice's hand off. Crane. Yeah, that's what he said. Really? Are you sure? Huh. Okay. Right. Shoot, did they know about my addiction to my little here. pony? Uh, that's weird. Okay, we'll get you to the other side. Right when? Right now. And what about payment? What you did to Rice, that's more than enough payment for us. Go to the collapsed tunnel that led to Old Town. Knock at the door that leads to the sewers. Someone will take good care of you. Will do. Thanks. Nah, man. Thank you. No, thank you. Alright, we're going to the tunnels. That's creepy out. A lot. So much. Spider-Man, Spider-Man, does whatever a spider can. Oh, I just felt it right over his head. Nice. Holy crap, holy. Alright, let's mess these dudes up. Oh, you want to rock? Stop resisting! Stop resisting! Haha, <laughs> suckers. So the last time I did this, I was supposed to save him someone and I think I accidentally killed him. I don't even know how to repay you. I don't really know if I like you, but I guess I'll let you go. Smell. Smell a little weird. I can't imagine what those bastards would have done to us. I'm just grateful I'm still alive. Okay. Cool. You guys are now safe. You've been hashtag saved. Uh, let's see at the map. Uh. Okay, I still got a ways to go. Oh, that is Totes Rise's, uh, what should we call it? Tower there. I don't know if I'm welcome. She looks angry. I'll, uh, keep my distance. Oh, this grappling hook's freaking awesome. Hopefully this isn't like a super poor choice that I'm making. What? I don't ever think I've been over on this side before. This is nuts. Everything's good. <laughs> good that's in here. Oh, score. So, tin can and some coffee. We're gonna have a party! Woo! Um. Oh, it's 
down below me, okay. <clears throat> Definitely just almost broke my legs. But hey, it's okay. What am I missing? What am I doing wrong? Alright, there we go. Those zombies creep me out so much. Alright, I'm entering the sewers, what could quite possibly be a very creepy spot. At first, Jank was reluctant to even talk to me, but after I mentioned what I did to Rice, the saviors decided to give me a hand. They helped me get to Sector Zero. Sector Zero, Dark Thirty. Ugh. Hello, anybody home? It's super creepy in here. Oh. Please let there be a per normal person behind this door. Green? Yeah, that's me. Good to meet you. I'm Hazan. I'm going to be helping you change your scenery. So did you take Jade through too? Who? She's from here. Dark hair, pretty, tough as nails. Uh, maybe. Don't know. We don't always ask names. For a second there, I'm like, oh crap, is this a setup from Rise? That would suck. Alright. How bad could this possibly go? Probably not bad at all, right? So it's this secret base for underground dwellers. What do they call them? Chuds, subhuman creatures, okay, subhuman underground crane. dwellers or something. Oh my god, it's the guy. It's Dawood. Hello, Dawood. Well, well. Small world. Dawood, we need to talk about your situation. Sorry about the wild goose chase, but I couldn't risk you tailing me. These guys are pretty serious about following their procedures. This isn't fair to Salma. Salma and me are done. It's not the point. So, what is? You got something in mind? I've still got a gun, you know. Crane, we've got the rule. Everybody minds their own business. If you don't follow the rules, you don't go through. No problem. That's nuts. So they were probably on the verge of a divorce, and he just took the kid and ran. Crazy. Okay, from here on out, you're on your own. The route is marked. I'll stay in touch over radio. It's been a pleasure, my friend. <laughs> I don't know if it's a good thing or bad. We need to do this one by one, and this man needs to go first. But he just got here. We've been here for hours. I don't read the rules. Wait here. <laughs> Oh, sorry. No word you could move it. I was standing on it. I just want to kick this kid into the... Right down there. <laughs> 